Get over here! Oh, I thought that was gonna hurt me for a second. I was like, oh no, lava! <laughs> Not quite. Um, we're just back at the area where we fought uh, Hornet for the first time. We we are due for a rematch with her, but that's not going to happen until later. Um, it is not. Um, yeah, if you go over here, then, yep, that's the exit. Alright, so, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to episode 32 of Let's Play Hollow Knight. I am the Green Scorpion. I'm Pad. Alright, so, where do you want to go? We can either... Ooh, hey there. Yeah, oh, yeah, you removed the Thorns of Agony, didn't you? I did. I'm not sure I agree with that, but it's up to you. Hey, you gotta try out different stuff. Yeah, so currently you have equipped the uh, Shape of Oon and the uh, Soul Catcher, correct? Ooh, I ran into him. Yep. Alright, so... Yeah, the Soul Catcher actually gives us a lot, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Alright. It does. Watch, I'm gonna forget to use the Shape. I mean, it kind of reminds you when you, like, it just, it, it basically turns you into a little squid. A little wormy guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's admittedly adorable. Yeah, it's alright. <laughs> alright, awesome. So yeah, if you go up uh, this way, you should be, you should find a uh, new area. At least one we haven't explored currently. Here we go. Here's a map. Uh, yeah, this is actually... I think this is close to... Dirt now? Oh, thanks, Rock. Well, we haven't, uh... We haven't had that issue in a while, have we? Nah. You move pretty fast. Yeah, you're... you do. Not that I'd be using it for, like... Play. There's no music here. Yep, nope, there is not. Oh, we got something here. Bang. Uh. Oh! 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 Oh, oh enemies! Frick. Oh, wrong. Wow. Okay. Okay, easy, man. Oh, this is a bunch of things. You gotta use the vengeful soul against these I things. I no idea. I just. I would have recovered health. Oh, I didn't even notice. I was paying attention too much in projectiles. I th I don't think thorns of Ag removing the thorns of agony was a good idea. Uh, we're gonna try again. All right, we'll be right back, guys. Yeah, there he is. There he is. Oh, nice. All right, so let's try this again. Mhm. Mm Ooh. Wow, did I really get 400 in my way back here? No, that was, I'm um, just stupid. That was my soul. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say. I'm um, done. No. Alright. You got another shot. I know. Just give me a sec. Try it more. I kind of want to just... Okay, there you go. There we go. Yeah, he's good. I'm like kind of. I think I'm out of range now, of the fireballs at least. Oh, you're not those, out of range of those things. Those though. they like kind of rebound. Um, like you hit them and then it'll come back at you before you can actually hit it again. Like you're you're just not swinging fast enough. No, see, there's a there's a minimum. I'm no. Okay, it's a timing thing. Mm -hmm. It's an exact. But like if you if you mash, it won't. Yeah, if you mash, no. Okay. Come on, give me a... Come on. Ooh. There you go. That one was a pain. A damage. There you go. There we go. Yep. All right, you might as well might as well get that uh, shortcut off. Yeah, over here. Yeah. There we go. That works. 
Alright, what do we get for our troubles? Oh, there's something down there. Yeah, there is. A, a boulder shell. shell. That's a badge, I think. It is a badge. What do we got here? Way up. You can check it. I could. There it is. Balder shell. The shell is not... Oh. Uh, oh, a shield, a shield to protect you when you're focusing soul. Interesting. It is not indestructible, though. I wonder if it combos with the one that lets you move that we just got. I don't imagine... I imagine it does. There's a grub here somewhere. You can hear it? Yeah, oh, yeah hear go it. back. Oh, there he is. All right. Mine. So I think we want to keep heading up, right? I think so. Snow? Hmm, or ash or something. That was weird. This is it! The Howling Cliffs! The Cliffy Dell Howls. And, oh, nice! We got a dream tree. A dree. I'm pretty sure that's not what it's called, but whatever. It's totally what it's called. Alright. Just get these. Just get this essence. There's gotta be some. Collect the red coins. Okay, we got 897. When did we get so much dream essence? I don't know. I have a dream that all Hollow Nest will be united. And yeah. Don't start. Yeah. Okay, so I got. I'm like not picking these up in any logical order. They're kind of spread all over the place. Yeah, but I feel like there's still got to be some kind of path. There's like one over here. There we go. I lost like half of those. <laughs> they probably fell on the ground down there, so yeah, if you but go I'm not down. Going, I'm not going back down there for a couple of those. There's probably a few of them because you've got that other geocache. I mean, how much do we need money? Point taken. No! No! Oh. Real smooth. Let's play the game where you try to not hit the platform. <laughs> you did mention that one. Uh, area, like the abyss or something. That looks like a breakable wall. Mm. Yep, that is a breakable wall. Hello. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. These blasted plains stretch never-ending. There is no world beyond. Those foolish enough to traverse this void must pay the toll and relinquish the precious mind this kingdom grants. It's just like the outskirts of the nest. I suppose it is. Oh! Something. Wanderer's Journal. Another one of these guys. Alright, there's still Dream Essence around here, so... Yeah. Uh, yeah, probably like one more. I guess Cornifer was here, but it looks like we missed him. We we did get all the maps actually. Now that I remember, I uh, yo yo that's actually the reason why we have the map of this place because mm -hmm. we bought it back at his Zelda's. Mm -hmm. Fine with me. Oh my god, how many more are there? I don't know. We're gonna hit a thousand at this point. I don't know about that. But... Nope. Well, you hit the platform, but you also hit an enemy. <laughs> yeah, indeed I did. I've heard of people playing Steel, Steel Soul and getting, like, all the way through and then dying to one of those things. Like, getting, like, all the way through the game. What do you mean? Steel Soul mode. Steel Soul mode? Yeah, you die, you lose your save. What? 
Yeah, you die once and you lose your save. And I've heard of people like getting all the way through and then dying to one of those guys to the tick. -tick. I think I saw some more down. Dying to a tick tick. Oh, that's terrible. For them. That's for all me, of it. For me, it's hilarious. Of course it is. Nah, that that that'd be terrible. I would not want to do Steel Soul mode because I would not want to uh, lose all my progress like that, especially in a long game like this. I mean, where dying beeline. is a common thing. Make a beeline for the bosses, I guess. I'm pretty sure there's a fast way. Um, check the map real quick. Him. Um, go back down to where Cornifer's uh, recorder is. Well, we don't know if we were there or not, because this isn't the full map. Well, if we were there, then we would have seen it already. Okay. Because we rested at a bench before at a bench before this, so if we were there... No, I, this, is a, this is our first time here. Okay. Just humor me. I have a feeling. These things are everywhere. Oh, there is something over here. Okay. Yep. Recover your health. I listen to no one. Okay. <laughs> that is way too adorable. Nothing there. Hmm. It's weird. Alright. Hope I heard something making like spurty noises. Oh, that's just them dying. Oh, you're right, it is. Alright, don't move too much around in this area. Oh, where did they come from? Oh, they just appear. Yeah. As did the spikes beneath my feet. I sort of knew that was going to happen, though. Well, that's knockback for you. <laughs> okay. Real uh, smooth. Scrub. Real smooth dingus. Yeah, they came out of nowhere. <laughs> Surprised you didn't use the Mothwing cloak. Three for three. We're still breaking even here, so... I mean, it's fine. We're at full health, so we don't really need to worry about breaking even. True. True enough. Ooh. I think there's a cocoon in here. Wow. Yeah, they come out of nowhere. Not there. Yep. Bye. That's a breakable floor. One second, I want to see what's over here first. Sure. Oh, it's a door. Dang it. So oh, that's a shortcut. Okay. Okay. okay oh, that's, that's what that was. Yeah, that's what that was. Okay, cool. What do we got here? There's some blue crystals there. Oh. This is very blue. Oh, this is pretty. This is pretty cool, yeah. I like the blue. Wow. There's like butterfly flowers. Oh? Joni's mm. blessing. Blessed oh. by Joni, the kindly heretic transfigures vital fluids into blue lifeblood. Oh. The bearer will have a healthier shell and can take more damage but they will not be able to heal themselves by focusing soul. Oh! That's interesting. Ah, I see you bear my blessing. I can't remember giving it, but my memory has been a little lacking of late. Okay. Oh. I killed her. Thanks, Joni. Interesting. Okay, so we got a badge out of that. Cool. Up with the butterflies. I'm not sure how I feel about that one. That seems a little debilitating if it's going to keep you from healing. I mean, if it gives you, like, double the amount of mask you have, then maybe, like, maybe? right before a boss fight? Maybe. Question mark. Maybe. Still, I'm not too sure about that. I, I like being able to heal. Alright, so yeah, that was worth going through.
Man, there's no music in this place. Oh, what do we have here? I'm Gorb. I'm Gorb. Bow, 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 bow to Gorb. The great mine. I am Gorb. Ascend, 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 ascend with Gorb. Oh, he's a warrior dream. All right, what do we got here? Gorb. Gorb. What are you doing? Gorb, oh, Gorb. Jesus. Gorb, Gorb. Gorb, Gorb. Gorb. Ooh. Okay, when he's charging like that, yeah, watch out for that. Gorb. Okay, interesting. Oh, that isn't that is awesome that you can do that now. Burp. Burp, burp. Oh. oh, two shockwaves now. Yeah. And they alternate. Yep. All right, all right, not bad, not bad. Ooh, that was predictable. Burp. Oh, teleport. Oh, he's teleport. He's teleporting now. Not entirely not Oh! Oh, is he gonna teleport any time- every time you hit him now? Well, wow. not every time. Wow, I'm like- he's like hitting me more than I'm hitting him. You're oh, not aim- fuck. you're not aiming your- you're not aiming your strikes. Oh my god. Yeah, I know I'm not. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna like- OH MY GOD! Wow, dude! <laughs> you didn't even die to the dream boss. No, I didn't. That's what makes it great. Uh, oh, and we're all the way back here? Yeah. Uh boy. We'll be right back. Gorb, gorb. Right. We may want to get our soul back. Which the is, I think... The map is, like, all, like, weirded out. I Notice think it's that? down... I think it's down where you died. Yep, there he is. There we go. All right, so why don't we hit that bench first? Yes. I think it's down there. Yeah, it is. It's in here. What? Huh. There's something, something hidden here, too. What is this? Uh. Wait, we've seen this is a art nail art, dude. No, it's not the nail art, dude. Or, it's not the artist guy. Nail Master Mato. Yeah. I'm impressed you found my sanctuary here at the top of the world. No doubt you've endured many trials and overcome many foes in your quest to find me. No, don't speak a word. I, Nail Master Mato, who was taught the art of the nail by the great nail sage himself, hereby accept you as my pupil. Let us begin the lesson immediately. Well, I guess we got it now. <laughs> Why not? We're here. Gasson! I really like those animations. The Cyclone Slash. Hold Y. Concentrate energy, hold Y to... Oh, okay. So it's like the Great Slash, except so you press up or down. Huh. Your form, ex... Hey. Sorry. I hope you don't think me too forward when I say that I consider you to be my child. Yes. When I saw you perform my nail art, I felt a bond between us suddenly flash into existence. You honor me beyond words, my pupil. Thank you. Bum. Cool. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. All right, so we got that now. Um. So, shall we try again against the dream yeah. enemy, the dream boss? Gotcha. Yeah. Let's do this. It's a good thing too. Like you found that bench, so we can actually. So we got something. We got something else out of it too. So that's nice. Okay. <laughs> that's so cute. Weird. Yeah, it is. All right, let's try this again. Corb, go Corb, for it. Corb, 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 Corb. Oh, I don't like the angle that he's at. It's like too low to hit with the uh, jumping, and if you jump, it's not. It's like not good. Cause you'll hit him. Corb, 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 Corb. I'm not a fan of the sound effects this guy makes. Corb, Corb. Corp, corp. 
If you're willing to use the soul, you also have the Howling Wraiths. I do. I think those actually do a decent amount of damage. They do. Yeah, it's like I keep trying to like jump, like tap, jump to hit him. You're definitely doing better than you were last time. Yeah. Patience is probably the thing. Nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's like slightly staggered. One, yeah. two, three. Yep, just patience and get those hits in. Like, yeah, he he's 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 got a lot throw, uh, going against going after you, but it's a fairly understandable pattern. It's pretty easy to get once you get used to it. Mm -hmm. oh, that was. Teleporting always kind of is like ah, disorienting. He's doing it more now too. Yeah. Gorb, gorb. Why are you doing that? There you fun. go. I don't know. I like it. Nicely done. I yeah, like you definitely it. did. You definitely did really well in that second in that second shot. Yeah, he wasn't that bad though. Listen. Gorb, I am Gorb. I am Groot. The great, the great mind, the pain, ascend, ascend. I am, I am. Dead. And that is another hundred a essence. There you go. We got a thousand essence now. Nicely done, man. All right. All right. Awesome. All right. So it looks like it here, looks like yeah. if we keep going forward, we're gonna end up in dirt mouth. Mm -hmm. Yep. Geronimo! Um, yeah! Back in the tutorial. We're back at the King's Pass. Actually, while we're here, there is something we could, uh, we can, uh, get here, uh, that we didn't get last time. Um, there is a badge, apparently, hidden here that we could have gotten before, but we didn't do the whole, uh, bouncing on spikes sequence break, uh, bullcrap. Where is it? At the beginning? At the um, end? I believe it's up higher. Like, it's past that cocoon. Well, this takes us back. Yeah. <laughs> I saw it too, I was like, nope, not happening. Mm-hmm. All right. If you go down here, I think, yeah. Oh, there's a geocache here too. Not nearly as useful as it was before. Nope. Still, it's nice. There's something down there. Yep, this is it. Hmm. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. Within our land, do not hide your truth form. Let all bask in your majesty, for only this kingdom could produce one such as you. And we get... Ooh. There we go. The Fury, Fury of, of the, the Fallen. Fallen. That looks like a really aggressive badge. Um, do you want to check it out? Um, yeah, sure. Fury of the Fallen. There it is. Embodies the fury of heroism that comes upon those who are about to die when close to death, the bear's strength will increase. That's neat. That's interesting. Though I'm not sure how comfortable I would be fighting with, with only one HP. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's not just only one. I think it's like a scale, maybe. Maybe. Or it's like Paper Mario, where you're building. Uh... Did I tell you I played that whole game with five HP? Are you serious? Yeah, thousand year door. You did not play a thousand year door with only five mm -hmm. HP. Yeah, I did. I, I did. I did a really fun build. There's an item that when you're below five HP, it gives you like plus one or plus two damage, and you just stack them because you can buy them. How do you? They're one badge point, so you just stack a bunch, so you do you do like fifty damage. How do you fight the Shadow Queen with that? Um, very careful. <laughs> Goodness gracious, man! I did it. It was that was probably the that was probably the hardest part because you have to kill her in I think three turns, and if you don't kill her in three turns, you lose. Wow! You just like you you get a lot of damage, and then you you do the multi bounce, the one that lets you hit a a a a, and you do multiple hits, and it uh -huh. just attracts by one every time. So if you're if your highest base damage is like thirty, you do thirty, twenty nine, twenty eight, twenty seven. I see. And you do a ton of damage. 
But I played the whole game like that. So you're constantly in danger. 100% of the time. I never would have considered doing something like that. that you so are a madman. That was so fun. It's like a glass cannon build. Wow. Oh. All right. People who say well, you can't do builds in Paper Mario. <laughs> well, here we are in Dirtmouth, and I think this is a good place to stop. So, thank you guys for joining us for episode 32 of Let's Play Hollow Knight. In the next episode, quite frankly, I think it's time, man. We are here. Okay. I I want to I actually want to get at least the first ending, okay. so that that way it opens up the floodgates so we can maybe explore more of the kingdom's edge okay. and find Hornet. All right. All cool. right. Sounds like a plan. Thank you guys for joining us, and we'll see you next time.